The Silver Cross Handicap Hurdle is next. It's a Grade 3 Handicap Hurdle. At the top we've got Oil Baron for Graham Clitterbuck, Balmoral Castle, Paul Rhodes, Mauritius, Darren Thompson, Aspectus Nardis, Thomas Rogers, Philomena, Paul Rhodes, Walter Mantin, Padre Hogan, Kingsdale Grands, David Robertson, Walt Luane and Sanwar for Stu Gray, Starship Sign for John Morgan, Pembry Matt Cooper and Distinctive Sharona for Derek Hinton. A field of 12. And away they go. Very sure onto the first. They're all safely over to it. And Distinctive Sharona and those distinctive pink and black collars of Derek Hollywood Hinton take the lead and walk on past the winning post with two complete circuits of the Aintree track to go Water Mountain is about five minutes back in second as we see them racing away from us the crowd still maintaining social distancing even though nobody else in the world is and it's distinctive Sharona in the lead from Water Mountain second and then Aspectus Nardis is third. Whoops, Luane is after that one. And Kingsdale Grounds on the inside of that one. Philomena in the orange. And the white sleeves is on the outside of it. And wider still, Mauritius. Oh, Darren Thompson looking towards the back. Starship sign for John Morgan the Great. The only great in the field is the back marker. And distinctive Sharona is bowling along nicely in the lead. A long run to this second flight which they will eventually get to and they do and they're all safely over it bit of a mistake though by Balmoral Castle the second of the two Paul Rhodes runners and distinctive Sharona skips over a third in front got Walton Mountain and Kingsdale Grounds and then Mauritius we got Walks of the Way after that one and Aspectus Nardis Get over the fourth, which they're all safely over looking towards the back. Starship sign has now been joined at the back by San Hua. Well, that's Stu Gray's favourite Chinese restaurant. There's a distinctive Sharona is in the lead. Rob Wolverton Mountain in second, Mauritius is in third, and Kingsdown Grounds is fourth. And Walks Luane and Aspectus Nardis as so they get over the fifth. All safely over that one. Lead up, bowling along nicely in front from Mauritius and Aspectus Nardis and walked away, and they're pretty tightly packed. The rest of them, this leader's got a full length advantage on them, and the rest of them are covered by no more than five. And distinctive Sharona has been steady into this next flight. It's over nicely, really good jump on the outside by Philomena. Has seen that one. Moving to second, Kingsdale Grounds is now third. Aspectus Nardis and Mauritius, then Walter Mountain on the inside. Oh, it's moving through the pack nicely. It's Pembury. That one was out in the back a minute ago. And it's now up into fourth as they go past the chair. And the winning post and the water jump. And now we'll head out for their final circuit. Distinctive Sharona is now about to be joined for the first time by Philomena. Gap of three lengths, then back to Mauritius. Kingsdale Grounds is fourth on the outside. Expect of Expectus Nardis. Then comes Wolverton Mountain. All Baron is creeping a bit closer. Pembury in mid division with Balmoral Castle. Waltz Luane has just dropped back on the outside. San Loire is going to, or San Loire is going to try and go up the inside. And Starship Sign just seems to be quite happy just tagging along at the back at this point. Getting down towards the final mile now. I'm not sure he's going to start making a bit of a move, I think. But it's Philomena and Distinctive Sharona who are matching strides coming into the next flight. This is the long run, of course, between these flights. And Philomena is now 
gone up by about a nick, half a length as they finally get to it and over it they go and a really good jump by the leader, seems to open up by two lengths, distinctive Sharon is now under pressure and been passed by Mauritius as well Kingsdale grounds on the outside, Pembry running a, running a big race, Walks Lorraine is now back into it again as they get over the ninth as distinctive Sharona starts to drop back Oil Baron made a mistake and is now the back marker but Philomena is in front over the fourth last, clear by a couple of lengths from Walks Lorraine who's really going well on the outside, Mar Riches and Kingsdale grounds are there as well. Pembry is still going nicely. Wolverton Mountain, now the grey starship sign starts to make a bit of a forward move. Balmoral Castle under pressure and Aspectus Nardis as well. Sanwar switched to the outside. All Baron and Distinctive Sharona are probably out of it. They've got three to jump. Over the third last they go and Philomena's clear of in second place Wharton Mountain Pembry moving through now Sanwar gets going on the outside and so too does Starship Sign they're heading towards the final two and it's Philomena in front Philomena from Wharton Mountain on the far rail Sanwar closes to us the grey who's wider still then is Starship Sign Kingsdale Grounds is still there so too is Mauritius they've only got two furlongs to go and they've only got two more flights to take and it's Philomena who's got to lead them into the second last, Philomena gets over it in the lead Sanwar over it second, Mauritius third, Wolverton Mountain, then Kingsdale grounds, looks to be going well, distinctive Sharon has been pulled up, but it's Philomena in front then with one to jump, Philomena over the final flight, lands in front, Sanwar is in second, Wolverton Mountain is trying to run on, so too's Mauritius, they've still got half a furlong to go, and Philomena's got the rail and got the lead, Sanwar is making ground, but not quickly enough and Philomena is going to hang on and take it from Sanwar in second, Philomena's the winner, Sanwar second, Mauritius third Third, then Water Mountain and Balmoral Castle. Oh, Baron got a second win. The Starship sign didn't really pick up at all. Well, it's Philomena for Paul Rhodes. Who's the winner? Sanwar for Stu Gray was second. Mauritius, Darren Thompson, the third. Water Mountain, Padraig Hogan was fourth. And Balmoral Castle for Paul Rhodes was fifth.